Hello. <laughs> hey guys, I'm with the sheep. Um, I might as well get some wool actually while I'm here. Um, so welcome to a, another episode of Let's Build. Um, we're still working on breed, um, not breed, chop. That's the thing actually, I was thinking the other day, if you, if you get a book, can you in, if you enchant shears with fortune, do you get more wool from sheep, or is three the maximum they drop even if you have fortune? Can they not drop anymore? So if you know, um, if you know the answer to that then uh, let me know. So I have, I don't know why I did that. This is the tavern, or the outside of the tavern anyway. Um, put a massive great big window at the front there. Um, but yeah, let's have a look at, I've done the roof. I'm not sure what to do about this part here, I might leave it. Uh, flat for now until we think of something. But um, I've done a what plank is it? Spruce wood roof. Um, not sure if it's too much wool though, like with these with these bits. But um, yeah, I did end up dropping it uh, down one one layer because it was just too high. So I guess we should start. Furnishing. Oh, I need to do these bookcases as well, actually. But anyway, so this is the upstairs. Um, thinking we, oh, so we need to make some rooms for the sailors or any guests that come to stay. Should we do these out of this wood again? Or spruce? I think if we do it with spruce, it's just going to be too much. Yeah, too much. Too much is too much. So we need to leave, uh, I guess I'll leave a, a thin corridor and then these should be. Oops. So they should be big enough for, for guest rooms. Oh, come on, what's going on with my block placement today? Dunk, 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 dunk. So these, oops. I've left the uh, ceiling up actually as well. Actually, I should probably light this up before something ghastly spawns. Um, yeah. I'm gonna need some more awkward. Luckily, I have some. Here's some I made earlier. Wrong chest, I believe. There we go. Uh, might as well dump some of this dirt uh, string. Don't need that, don't need that, don't need that, don't need that, and I don't need that. Hey, hate it when you just carry junk in your inventory. <laughs> it annoys me. And then the thing is, uh, you, you dump it in, you start dumping it in chests as well, and then you have chests just full of random things, which is never good. Um, where should this. Should this just go up to this line and then... Um, let's have a look. Let's see how it looks. Hmm. See, that's weird. Um, so these are going to be split off into... Let's say one... Three kind of. It only needs a bed and a chest, and really, doesn't it? A bed, bed, chest, table. Who's this? It's Foo. <laughs> Hello. He doesn't know I'm recording, so uh, <laughs> he's. Let me just tell him. Oops. <laughs> You're giving me a pet. Um. So. Oh. 
reference. <laughs> He's distracting me from my work. Uh, yeah, let's put this back. That looks fine. Um, let's see, I'm going to have to just block. Yeah, the roof doesn't have to be. I can do this. We can cut the roof off there. I'm just not good at the block placement today. And Dunk. Right. Let's get some torches down. And so a bed will come. Let me just disable chat again. Just in the case. There seems to be a lot of arguments going on the server today. I know I said in the first video that we're a friendly bunch, but um Just kids. Kids will be kids. So a bed. Three blocks. Chest. One block. Should I give them a table as well? If that's a doorway there. Yeah, that's a that's a good enough room. I have to go through here again and do it. Um, so, one, two, three. Ah! Damn! Right, let's. <gasps> oh, phew. I thought I'd run out of uh, planks. Chop the. Chop the doer. Um, so, yeah, we can trim a block off this now. So that's two rooms. Um, here. I'm wondering if we could put. Because I want this to be like a uh, a seating area. So yeah, let's put some some more rooms across here. So don't mind if it's too crowded. I'm trying to. The theme I'm trying to get is, um, again, we're going to be referring back to Final Fantasy. When you went into their buildings at top, I mean, they were very thin, not hallways, but uh, landings for the top of the stairs and stuff. And then there was, like, big rooms and, and things. So let me build this other room and uh, I'll be right back with you. So the uh, rooms are... Complete. This is a single guest room and another one. It's pretty much exactly the same layout. And then I um, thought I'd make a double because there was there wasn't enough space to make a single one. And then this is going to be like a uh, seating lounge area. The only thing I'm a bit <laughs> it looks a bit daft that um, it kind of look it re just reminds me of a house within a house. Houseception, <laughs> but um, I think that's just cause maybe maybe it's because I've left the the roof open, and what I should do is cut it off. Oh, I've just thought of that now. I should have done this off camera, but you know what? Potatoes to it, potatoes. And then I think we just need to. Oh, oh that's it. There we go. Then we need to just make some furnishings inside. There we go. That should be enough for um, the roof. The roof. I didn't steal anything from that roof, by the way. Shh. You didn't see me. <laughs> Yeah, I ran out of uh, stairs, and I couldn't. I couldn't be bothered to wait for the uh, trees to regrow. So, yeah, maybe this is gonna look better. Like I, oops, 
I did like the idea of having a open rooftop so you can see all the beams but maybe I could do it in this yes 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 ideas oh what nowhere near enough wood that's what she said yes I think where that um, seating area is going to be we can have that kind of open open to the elements I'm going to have to plant some more trees soon as well bye Haz Ooh. yeah Haz is um, he's building if he's watching this uh, he's building like an epic maze in uh, creative which is going to be good I think it's going I think he's doing four floors let's just Ah, it's a better view. Uh, yeah, I think he's doing a f like a four floor maze or something, which is going to be pretty good. Um, probably didn't get enough wood again. Don't know why I thought one tree would be enough. But oh well. So yeah, um, that'd be like a pretty. If it gets, um, especially if it gets like harder and harder. As he's as you uh, you know one floor maybe level one and then. The next floor and the next floor. Maybe with like um, different, like one floor will be zombies and then the next floor will be. Ah, oh, that looks better, doesn't it? Maybe we should put. I think, yeah, we should put a painting up there, maybe. Yeah. So let's get some lovely chairs. Um, how should we do this? I should do the chairs because I kind of want them to be looking out there. Hmm. Uh, the sofa may, might be too big. Let's just. Um. Hmm. Tell you, uh, tell you what I'll do is I'll just put um, two chairs. Like I, can't, I don't have any signs. Be right back. Down the stairs. Oh, this mouse is just about on its last legs as well, and looking forward to getting my new one from Razor. <gasps> oh come on! Why are you doing this to me? Back to the trees. So yeah, um, can't remember what mouse it is. Uh, yeah, because they always have weird names. But I um, managed to get it when they. I uh, don't know if you guys know, but there was a glitch at the tills on the Razor website, and you would get um, that's even the wrong wood. Yeah, you'd get ninety percent off all your orders. So I tested it out with a uh, a mouse mat and a keyboard. No, a mouse mat and a mouse. Tested it out with that, and it was like, yeah, I think this 50 quid mouse came to like 12 pound or something, which is ridiculous. So I uh, bought that. I think it was actually cheaper than the mouse mat. I think the mouse was 12 pound, and the mouse mat was 14 pound. And then, um, oh, I text signs. What am I doing? Yeah, and then I bought the the Deathstalker keyboard, which was 200 and. I think that was priced at two hundred and thirty-nine pounds, and that because it was ninety percent off, it came to like forty pound, including the uh, postage and packaging. But they haven't shipped that out yet, so let's just do the bog standard chairs, and then a table. out of signs yet again god damn it so yeah I'm just gonna do that um, those normal chairs and then if you guys have any I uh, want to I think that'll be enough no yeah it's gonna have to be nope I got some more wood there yeah if you guys have any ideas for that um, seating arrangement upstairs then let me know. 
Let's make this table look a bit. There we go. There we go. So yeah, if you guys have an idea for uh, what to do with these chairs, uh, drop it in the comments. Because um, I, I don't think we're gonna leave it like this. Maybe we could. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Um. I don't have any coloured wool. Damn, son. Um, I'll show you what I mean outside. But this, um, this might look a bit too, um, too posh. If you put, uh, do that. Do I have any? I do. So you can kind of do like um, a seat like this, but then you can. Uh, where are my shears? There we are. So now I, in my other house I have a, a sofa that's kind of like this. I think it's this way. Yeah. But then it looks a bit too posh. We'd obviously do it with coloured wool, but I think it looks a bit too posh for in there since it's like an old fishing village tavern type thingy me chickadee. Duda. This chicken keeps laying eggs down here. I keep hearing him popping them off. Maybe they just keep despawning. Uh, get out! Right. Land. There we go. So, what should we have down here? Definitely need to do these bookcases uh, next episode. Because I haven't got the resources at the minute for those. Um, fireplace. Here or here, get rid of this window. Yeah, 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 yeah. Get rid of this window. And we should have the chimney coming out. Um, if this hatches, oh my god, the only time I didn't want it, I should have just thrown it out. Uh, which this one. Still need to repair this sword. But I just don't have the XP in a minute. I just love it though, it's such a beastly sword. <laughs> Not sword. Spade. Okay. Right, so this is gonna let me think here. I have to delete these and Delete these. I just don't, if this sets on fire, it's all going to go up. <laughs> so this could go hold horribly wrong. Um. Oh, how the hell? Well, oh seeds again. Seeds in the inventory. I love me. So that's where the fire's gonna be. So there, that, 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 Oh, you can't fly over fences. <laughs> can't fly all now. Is it going to go through this room? Please don't. Oh, it is. Shoot. Well, let's just see what it looks like. If. Maybe it needs to come out more. Huh. Because I don't want it to be going into that room. That guy's room. <laughs> or girl. Whoever stays there. So, should we bring it out? 
some more. Oh, what is that as well? <sighs> Little things that bug me. <laughs> uh, I'm not too keen on this either. Maybe that should be fence post. Drop it in the comments, though. So. Oh, frame rate. <coughs> um. Yeah, so maybe this fireplace should come out a bit more. Let's try that. So thinking railings, fire pit, fire pit, fire pit, fire pit. It's going to catch on that anyway, isn't it? Is it going to? It's going to look odd if the chimney doesn't go all the way up to the roof. That's all I'm thinking. Are we going to have to extend this entire area? Oh, god damn, this has got me thinking. Hmm. Right, what I'm going to do is I'm going to work on this. Uh, let me just destroy this. I'm going to call it uh, an episode there, and I'm going to work on this chimney for next episode, and maybe uh, I might have to put it on this side. He's still going to go. Th uh, I'm going to have to, because I want it kind of. Um, I want it to come out, the chimney to uh, to protrude, to protrude from the wall, and then. Yeah, I might have to do it on this side. I can do it there, can't I? Yeah, leave it with me, guys, and I will. I'll sort it out. Um, in the meantime, thanks for watching this episode of Let's Build. Um, town's coming along slowly but surely. Um, if you guys want me to do more stuff on camera or more stuff off camera, uh, then let me know in the comments, and uh, that can easily be arranged. So uh, uh, leave a comment, um, leave some, oh, I've forgotten the word, I always forget my words, as soon as the mic turns on I just, ugh, my mouth goes to jelly, um, leave a, not recommendation, a suggestion, leave suggestions, there we go, there's the word, leave suggestions in the, suggestions in the comment section, and um, if you're feeling really generous, then uh, leave a like on the video. If you're feeling super, super generous, then uh, leave a favourite. Um, and if you're feeling fruity, then click the share button and uh, share it on Twitter or Facebook. Uh, it doesn't do a lot for you, but it does a l it does a lot more for me. Um, it just gets more people to see the videos and and such and such. So uh, cheers for watching guys, I do appreciate everyone who watches, everyone who um, is active on the channel and I uh, just appreciate you guys a lot in general. It hurts my heart. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'll see you next episode. Bye.